best known for its medieval architecture, its beautiful cobblestone pathways. The buildings here are so beautiful and they even date back to the Middle Ages. A unique aspect of this city is that it still has a lot of its buildings and its city walls still intact. So a lot of the German cities around here were completely obliterated from wars and this one actually has most of its architecture still here. It's actually one of only three that has a full city wall around it. So come with me as we go and explore this absolutely charming little city. You're on. Hey, can someone please come over here and get me out of here?
right now I am currently standing in the giant wall that surrounds the city of Rotenburg. As you can see, I've thrown on my rain jacket and my hat because it's gotten a little bit colder outside. We had beautiful sunny skies for most of the day, but now the rain and the storm clouds have rolled in. However, I'm so happy to be in this giant wall right now because I am protected from the rain and I'm able to check out some amazing bird's eye views of the city. It's pretty cool to think that these stone cutouts in the giant wall that surrounds the city are where the soldiers used to stand and keep watch to protect everyone. We're having so much fun walking through the giant wall that surrounds the city of Rotenburg. It's so crazy to think that soldiers used to stand up in these walls and be on the watch to protect the city. What'd you get? Um, what, what did I get? I get some roast beef and some potatoes. And it looks really good. I'm excited to eat. And some cranberries. Cannot wait. 
to be good. All right, so when I was researching things to do in Rotenberg, every single blog said that you had to try their iconic snowballs. So I thought I'd do it. Ooh, it looks like it's a big ball of fried dough. And I just got the powdered sugar one. So let's see how it tastes. <laughs> It's definitely messy, <laughs> but it tastes really good. It just reminds me of when my mom used to make pies at home and she'd have leftover dough and then we'd put it in the oven and just bake the leftover dough and put powdered sugar on it. That's basically what you're getting in the snowball. It's super cute. I definitely say give it a try if you come to Rotenberg.